Welcome back to Pizza Tower. Ooh, pizza. The Tower of Pizza. Pizza. Yeah, I've ever thought about getting like those Lunchables pizzas, you know? Get, oh, like, I get, miss like, those. And like, you know, make, make them all at once and then stack them on top of one another. Make an actual pizza tower. But then get like three of them, uh, and like make like like a pizza skyscraper. Oh my god, I've never thought of doing that. I just thought it'd be it'd be cheaper than getting like actual frozen pizzas to stack on top of one another. Yes. Well, now that Lunchables are not cheap anymore, <laughs> they're super expensive. Not that expensive. I mean, compared to you know, you could go pick up a frozen pizza for the price of making your pizza tower. Oh right, boss time. It is boss time. Oh shoot. We're finishing off floor four with. This boss. Oh my gosh, he looks so familiar. It's Pepino! Ourselves? Hi! I'm gonna turn the volume up for this one. <laughs> this is fake Pepino! They cloned Pepino! They're gonna make a Pepino's Pizza 2? Yup. Are you kidding? He's got all your moves, including the grab. He's, he's trying to grab you, don't let him do that. Yeah, he, he hurts when he grabs, but you gotta hit him twice before you can actually damage him. The small details in this fight are phenomenal. And then, of he, course, Fake Pepino has fake, fake Pepinos. I love that his health bar is just yours, but drippy. That's basically him. It's, he's Pepino, but drippy. drippy. He's a really bad copy. See, I thought this was just like an alien that took your form. Yeah. I didn't know they were actually trying to create a fake you Pepino Pizza 2. I think they, nope. seeing as how they couldn't, they can't get rid of me, they're just gonna make another one of me, or we're just gonna be another, another, uh, pizza in the conglomerate of, yeah. of, 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 of Pizza Head. This is a commentary on buying up Mon Pa shops. Exactly. Oh! Specifically this one. You take the local shops, turn them into, into big, disgusting chains. Oh big my god, this, this fight pattern. It's, it's like, look at me, kids, it's me, not Pino from the Pizza Tower. I do like, uh, fake Pepino's sound effects. <laughs> yeah, he's, uh, unsettling. Certainly a monstrosity. So, uh, I already knew about this boss, unfortunately. I loved watching a compilation of people's first time seeing this. Especially the ending. <laughs> and he's great. Nothing compares. <laughs> Nothing compares. Nothing compares. That is so so corporate jargon it hurts. <laughs> Nothing compares to Pepino's Pizza 2. So compared to the noise, Fake Pepino is a bit more structured, a little less random in, in his patterns and his movesets. He has the dash. I'm impressed. Why does it take extra hits to actually damage this foe? Make sure you really you really hit him, you know? Or really, really suck it to him, because because he's you! He's you. you. You can't have that. Oh, dear. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, uh, that, that wasn't one, too bad. That was annoying. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Ooh. yeah. He's getting faster, too. He can really get you if, if you're not careful. Whoa, 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 oh, whoa, whoa. yeah. This. Uh... Oh. Oh, you can, you can parry it. You can. Nice. You can also sniff the floor. I hate that. He's a brain. I hate that. He's a brain. That's uh, what he is. See, this is why I thought he was an alien. It was just like alien brain just coming in, just be like, I'm the Lee Pepino. <laughs> they, they, they just made a skin suit. Oh my god. They just made a skin suit. They're of all Pepino. over the place. Ah! Then he throws that one. Be careful. Oh, he even has the super taunt. He's got a super taunt, but oh. it has spikes. I want spikes on my super taunt. That's yeah, not me fair. too. Why does he get spikes? All right, we did it. Now you don't, you don't realize it, but we've wandered into the second phase already. Where's the health bar? The health bar's still black. I would like the health bar, Where's please. Where's fake Pepino is what I want to know. Where is he? There he is! Oh, there oh. he is! He shows up quickly with the grab, so be careful. Yeah. Oh, I I don't like what's happening in the background. Those are all the failed fake Pepinos. Yeah, and they, they take the oh. failed Pepinos and they make pizza out of them! Oh, that is that is some horror movie shit. It's like, hey, uh, hey, hey, Nisco, you want to get some pizza? Where do you want to go? Yeah. You want to go to Little Caesars? You want to go to pizza? Or you want to go to Pepino, 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 Pepino? <laughs> oh my god, I didn't notice it changed! And like, like their the classic back. slogan, Ferg seek to pull <laughs> his bad's redemptions! Okay, I didn't notice the background, like, the... I know the small background changes. I didn't even notice the the logo and everything. The saying changed. Holy shit! That's Pepino, awesome. Pepino, Pepino, oh, Pepino, Pepino is Pepino. God damn it! No. It's uh, really, 
it's a really fun boss fight though. It's, 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 it's really fun. It looks like it has a lot of good rhythm to it. It's 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 got a rhythm. It's it's just kind of you know, a little stressful because of the music and of course you know his unnerving demeanor. And uh, sometimes in the second phase when his uh, clones are attacking as well, it gets a little bit hectic. Just a but, tad. But when you learn the pattern, it just becomes muscle memory. God, what is going through Pepino's head right now? Besides, you know, the official WTF. Italian. I'm gonna shit to myself! I'm gonna die! Oh no! Just imagine if he had a slice just to, you know, compare the competition's pizza, and then he just thinks, Oh my god, this isn't milk. <laughs> it's, it's me. And then glaunches all over the place. So when these guys start falling, don't go in the corners. Oh, definitely. That's a trap. If I've ever seen one. Just like, like, like a tile or two away from the corner, and, and, and you'll be safe. I noticed when they're running on the ceiling, they can run into each other and cause themselves to fall. I, th I think they fall uh, when you run underneath them. Okay, here's this phase. Oh, n nice. Strike and a pose. You'll love huh. to see it. You'll love to see it. That yeah. was a very friendly pattern you just got there. Yeah, it's it's not it's not that bad of a of a of a pattern really. Like I, I haven't I haven't got one so bad where I'm on like the exact left and the exact right. I do love how many fake pepinos are logging on to Steam while you're doing this fight. Oh yeah, I know. <laughs> Everyone is fake pepino. I have I have friends. <laughs> I'm sorry to tell you this, Niskel. I have friends. I'm a, legit what? I'm a legitimate PC gamer. What? I really, I am. Okay, that's the bigger sin. <laughs> Not having friends, being a legitimate PC player. Get the hell out of here. That's why we're doing a Let's Play of Pizza Tower and not waiting for a Switch version, which I really hope happens. Yeah, we'll probably do that, too. <laughs> I love it. The only thing that's better than pizza is more fucking pizza! Give me all the pizza. Nothing compares! I don't care that it's bad for me. I just want more pizza. More pizza, please. Oh, he's a lighter green. Yep, that's that's the that's the eye trick. The second face is always a bit e a bit harder on the eyes and a bit harder on the, yep, on, on the I, brain. I see it. <laughs> but, for, but fortunately, uh, the hitboxes and when they can actually be you know like be damaged by. Ooh, what a dodge! Are are a little bit lenient. What a fucking dodge, my dude. Uh, yeah, that that's Holy certainly shit. was. He also stays vulnerable for a pretty good amount of time, too. Oh, that's so. good. That's good. Yeah. Tossing heads, tossing heads. Don't be greedy on this one. I've yeah, lost don't... too many uh, trying to think I could hit him before he could throw and... his head. And I get hit by the other oh! head. Oh! Holy shit! How? How did, on earth did, did you do that? that? That's that's the most difficult part, I'd that say. That was so good! Because those dick backs. Ah! Oh, run! 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 Holy shit, run! Holy shit, run! Surprise third phase! Just run! Just run! I mean, it's not that demanding, but dear God, do you gotta run! This is instant death, isn't it? It is instant death! It, there's there's no coming back from that. If you come back from P rank, I mean, of course you. It's, it's, it's... Yeah, yeah, yeah. P come on, Pete, let's go! Yeah, he's still coming. Let's he's go, still Peps. coming. Peppy boy, let's and go! And made it. Yeah, I, I want to get a good so look. So let, let's let's get a good look yeah, at him. Yeah, I want to get a good look at him. us here. Uh, eventually. You you were pretty fast. Yeah, yeah. Oh god, whoa! Yep, don't like that. Oh, we did it. Oh, it was Bruno's Pizza. Condemned Pizzeria, and they decided to turn it into Pepino's 2. Do enter, not inside. Oh, you're one of those. Hey, but you get a free drink. Well, look how they wrote it. I mean, come on. And danger. Let's see it. Let's see it. <laughs> yes. Oh, that was a beautiful fight, mate. I know it took a couple tries, but that, that last fight was beautiful. Not, not too demanding, not too demanding. Just, uh, just, you know, what, like, what, half an hour or so? That's not too bad. Not too bad. Not too bad. Pretty good. All right, now for that secret. I was... The lore it for Fake Pepino is really good. I really enjoy it. And it threw... Whoop, oh, there, there it was. I saw it. Let me in. This fan can be a little zealous sometimes. Yes, 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 yes. It's the Noisette Cafe. Oh. So this just would have been a special area. This is where the Noisette drug the noise at the end of his boss fight, and the oh. vigilante's having some tea here. Oh, that smile is uh, that's something. <laughs> Piano keys, <laughs> straight up. I like how the vigilante's like, ah, jeez, this guy. Oh, it only happens when you get close. I love it. Oh, she turned the noise into bread. Oh, I'm not having that sandwich. Nope, don't want it. All right. 
it's time for us to move on to the final floor of Pizza Tower. That make is sure we, nuts. Make sure we keep Snotty alive. You've gone far enough, buddy. All right. Good show, I say. I want to change my clothes, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's wanna, get out of these green rags. I want to dress into a little bit something more appropriate. Oh, pizza! Uh, I like pizza! You don't like see, pizza. Look at, you know, bowling, uh, bowling, bowling stripes, stripes are pretty good. pretty good. Bad, but... It's got to be pizza. Thank you. It has got to be pizza. What the, else can it be? The green reminds us of fake Pepino too much. I mean, we're fighting for... For pizza. We're fighting for pizza. For the sake of pizza. And now, here's where we get into some of the real lore. Oh, yeah? Into the fifth floor. The final top floor of Pizza Tower. Are you saying we get more lore on fifth floor? Stuff oh. only. Oh. That's the real John Gutter back there. Oh, ew. There's only three levels. Only three. Oh my god. Uh, yeah. They lose some P rank. You can get it by doing everything there is to do in a level. Uh, no. Yikes. I, I, I don't feel bad if... Yeah, 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 I don't want to do it. I don't feel bad. Oh, guys. Uh. <laughs> No fear, I get it. Yeah, yeah no, you guys, no fear, no you, fear. You guys are cool. Yeah, brick smoking a cigarette and everything. God, the the real John Gutter's being taken over by pizza. All right, well, here's our first level of the last floor. There's a blood bag right there. This is Pizza Scare. <laughs> <laughs> what? It's a revamp of Pizza Scape, but with a little bit more horror put into it. Ooh, a revamp level? The priests are now, I, I guess, crusaders, and they give you uh, d holy death power. What? And you can kill ghosts, too. One of the chef tax is killing 30 ghosts. Would it be? We're also getting followed by this King Cheese ghost. Are you saying we got help from Pan Helsing? Well, everybody has a Van Helsing of their own. It's a personal Van Helsing. Look, I tried. Oh! <laughs> I was almost discouraged that I didn't get a <laughs> wow, good job, and instead got a double up. You got one up instead. Got some stuff crossed. So you see how the cheese is uh, kind of following us in those traps there? That was, ew! I don't like this one. <laughs> I saw a skull covered in cheese. Yep. Yeah, so, uh... He's going to be uh, showing up in anchors, outlets, and uh, ball-pushing machines. The idea is not to get hit by any of those things that hurt you. Like, like that. Just like that. Second playthrough, here we come. All right. Um, oh, yeah, where are our challenges? Uh, the, I don't think we ever got those. Uh, the first one was killing 30 ghosts. Oh, okay. With the, with the special crusader powers. The second the second one is uh, don't get hit by those uh, traps there. And the third one is those skull blocks you just saw there. Yeah. Destroy them all. Oh, that doesn't seem All bad. these skull blocks. So far, so good. I'll give him this. The horror in the background. That's some good stuff. This is the horror floor. Oh, that actually explains a lot. For Pizza Tower, at its core, when it first started, was meant to be a horror game. No way! It was meant to be a horror game. No way! It was meant to be a, 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 a semi-comical cartoon survival horror game. What? Using RPG Maker, but because RPG Maker was a little bit too uh, limiting in terms of animation, he decided to go Game Maker, and then, well, it turned into a Wario Land remake, Oh! That's that's some good information. I didn't know about that. But looking at the horrifying art style in certain faces, yeah. of course it was meant to be a horror a horror game. Naturally. What else was it supposed to be? I don't know. Funny Pizza Man game. I don't know. And it is a funny Pizza Man game. But now we're gonna get into scary funny Pizza Man game. God, how many games that are comedic slash horrifying have we done? Well, uh, quite a few. <laughs> you, you're, you've seen Kill and Kill before, right? Oh yeah. Uh. Jordan Peele has been known to say that uh, horror and comedy are, are hand in hand, basically. Because the way that, that a lot of their punchlines and setups are done are kind of the same. Which is why when you watch that show, a lot of his, uh, his, uh, of his sketches are indeed funny, but also kind of scary as well. Mm -hmm. A little bit of a creepy uh, demeanor towards it. I mean, hey, they have Halloween specials too. Oh, and also... Uh gone on to direct a couple fantastic horror films. That's why people swear that The Cable Guy is a hilarious movie. 
<laughs> it's a horror film. It's 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 it's, it's terrifying. It's a sociopathic uh, menace. How's yeah. that? <laughs> but, uh, but Jim Carrey's funny. He's not funny. He's no, intimidating no, that, and brutal. What's wrong with you people? That is probably one of my favorite things to see comedians play horror roles. I'm just reminded of a. Uh, is it NCIS where they got uh, Tim Curry to play an evil dude? Where don't they get Tim Curry to play an evil dude? Psych got Tim Curry on their second episode. Well, there's also the uh, the Robin Williams film where he plays a stalker. Robin <laughs> Williams is in Law and Order. He was? He was in Law and Order as for you. Oh shit. Oh, it was fucking great. And you know, of course, uh, he gets he gets uh, arrested at the end. Oh. But he kind of looks. He's like, oh, excuse me. Uh, can I tie my shoe? He, he leans down to tie his shoe. Looks back. Beep hits a button, causes an explosion, distracts Olivia and and, uh, and and Stabler, and he takes off and is never seen again. What? All right, it's pizza time. Let's get the hell out of here. Yeah, let's get out of here. Oh, oh, I love that Brick is all dressed up as pizza. Does every uh, side character wear your uniform? Uh, whatever color you're wearing, the other characters wear it too. Oh, and you need to free the ghost. Okay. That was a really confusing uh, esca uh, escape time. Yeah, oh, definitely. Oh, dude, please. Get it. There we go. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, Get that skull. I, I, I don't like the skulls in the back. They're so, looking at me funny. So if you're going for all the top ends and all the secrets and all that, the skulls are pretty easy to get. There's none, like, hiding behind, you know, secret areas or whatever. Nothing that mean. It's pretty self-explanatory, it looks like, yeah. It's, it's meant you to flow the together. You're, you're, you're supposed to do... Oh, I, I, I guess I got all the ghosts. What? There's, there's more than 30 ghosts in the level, so if, oh, you're, if okay. you're trying, you know, there's a there's a really big margin of error, especially if you go into Secret 3. Oh, okay. The thing is, though, it happens so quickly, I didn't realize I fucking got it. Yeah, I, I missed it, too. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, uh, Secret 3, which we'll get to here in a second, has plenty of ghosts that'll get you over the edge. Oh, but, okay. But I did okay. it so well and so quickly, I didn't realize that. I, well, I didn't get it! Well, damn, I gotta go back and try it again, You're then. just a master player, then, aren't you? I, I guess so. Maybe I should go for those P-Ranks. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, don't do that to yourself. Don't do that to yourself. Your, your mental health is just... You, you can't go for the P-Ranks all the time. It's hard enough getting S-Ranks. You can't get fucking S-Ranks. Are you kidding me? Get out of here. Well, also, doing it against the bosses is just an achievement in itself, because, you know, have you seen their movement patterns? Get out of here. They don't even count for the all P-Ranks in the stage. There's all the skulls! Yay! Yay! Wait, really? Yeah. That's oh. All. Well, it's, it's just an extra achievement. That's all it is, yeah. An extra pat on the back for you. Good job, man. Oh, oh wait, yeah. Hey! I didn't know those bats did that. This is the second secret! Wait, what? Yeah! Oh. Well, uh... Oh, isn't this a fine kettle of fish, Papino, my boy? Yeah, the, the two secrets, and Jerome, and the treasure room are all Whoa! after pizza time. It's, 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 it's down here. Really? Right there? Yeah, there's a, there's a hidden platform there being hidden by that bit of foreground. Oh, there is. Oh, that's neat. Alright, now what? Treasure room is actually very close. Right. It's right, it's right uh, underneath those bowling pins over there. To do that, we have to jump over that ramp, basically. Right over here, get hit by this thing. Oh, good lord. Ah! Oh, good lord. Okay, 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 okay. okay, okay, okay I see okay, your game. Okay, okay, all right, all right, all right, all right, all oh, right. Oh, I love this. Yeah, kill the get ghost. Get rid of that guy. Kill the get rid ghost. of that guy. And then, get kicked. Run. Run, run, run. We're running out of time here. Let's kind of speed things up a little bit. Just a little bit. All right, here we go. Here's that. Boom. That is devious. Oh, it's hey. it's chicken wing, a big old mutton chop. Mm. All right. Just reminds me of how much I love chicken bacon ranch pizzas. Maybe we can put all these ingredients together and, and make a Pepino's cholesterol caper or something. <laughs> uh, uh, death by cholesterol, yeah. Ah, meat lovers got so much meat it'll make you a meat hater. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. So here's where all the ghosts are. There's one, two, three, three four, four, five, five six, six, seven, eight, eight nine, nine, ten. ten. Oh, just 10. Then you gotta actually try for these, but, uh... 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, <laughs> 17 to 18 ghosts there, so... It, wow, okay, yeah, that that helps you finish up the rest. Yeah, b basically. Uh-oh. Oh, there you are. Where are you going? I'm, I'm, I didn't think I got the ghost achievement. Because oh. it went by so fast. <laughs> I didn't get it! Why did you get that last one over here? Oh, man! See, I thought you were gonna be cheeky and be like, "Yeah, lap two when Pizza Face is right in, right here." <laughs> yeah, exactly. <gasps> Run for your life.
Well, we gotta do that again, though. It's alright. That's okay. We gotta... And we got all the toughens. We got uh, the trophy and everything. Or the, the, the treasure. But now we gotta... Not get hurt by the ghost trap. Sounds easy. It sounds easy, but it... Well, a little bit. Just gotta do what what Pizza Tower is known for best. Go slow. You just, you just gotta play it over and over again until you know where everything is, and it's just a matter of muscle memory. Alright, be honest. How long did it take? This whole thing probably about, like, a little less than an hour. Ew! The, the <laughs> Pino face is in the back! Ew! Yeah. The, told you. It's, it's, this is horror, the man. The noise faces? What the fuck? It's horror! Santa's back there! Brick and Gustavo Shit. are back there! Ew! This is a horror-themed level, man. It's time to get afraid. I love it. I enjoy when games go horror. You see why it's called Pizza Scare? Because it's scary! It's, it's, it's scary pizza! Scary for like a five-year-old, and yet I'm over here being like, Ew! You ever seen a pizza that made you go, ah! <laughs> Oh my god! That's a good topic. Hey, anybody there in the audience, have you seen a legitimately scary pizza? Yeah, when they had pineapple on it! <laughs> oh, that's too easy. I'm talking... Real fear. Real fear. Hmm. Real fear pizza. Real, the only real fear of pizza are just like, you know, imaginary pizzas that you, that you can only dream of. I made a dessert pizza once. And the only ingredients I had were fake chocolate sauce, sprinkles, and bacon. You had me until the bacon. It wasn't good! You had me until the bacon. It was horrifying! It's like, it's like oh, well, uh, chocolate sauce and, and sprinkles. That sounds like it's gonna be a bit of a... a bit, bit of a, you know, bland and L uh, little uneventful. Little sugar fied, yeah. It's, it's not gonna be like, you know, like no fruit or whatever, or anything. That's, but that, that's, that, that's, that, that's, that's, that, that's, that, that's, that, that's, that's fine. But, and then you, then you said bacon, and then, then there were, there were concerns. I just, I just can't have bacon on pizza. It's, it's too, it's too greasy and it oversalts the whole thing. And it's just, it's unpalatable anymore. People go crazy with bacon sometimes. I, I can do it. Not a lot of it though. I get, I get it. I get it. If you give me like a couple slices that has bacon on it, I'm like, yeah, sure. I'll hate myself the rest of the night, but it's like, mmm, that's delicious. Chris is the BLT as well because you also have the crunch of the, of the lettuce and the acidity of the tomato to offset that. So we were talking about. BLTs. Yeah, BLTs. At, at one point. BLT pieces. And, gotta say, was never a fan back in the day. Really good now. Yeah, right? Mmm. I can do a BLT pizza. I'm not a fan of sandwich pizzas. I think they betray it, but that? That's a, that. That's legit. That's okay. Yeah, I that's can do That's okay. That. No harm done there. All good there. And yet, my dad loves a good BLT pizza with no mayo. <laughs> Well, that's not a BLT. It's got to be a it's pizza. Just a, it's just a pizza with bacon, lettuce, and tomato on it. Yep. I was like, well, that just missed the point. I was looking at a margarita pizza or whatever. Oh, Damn it all! Oh, dude! Ooh, Ooh erg. Gragglegurg. Uh, you had to mention another good pizza, the margarita, and then, you, then you just like, I did. And you goofed it. All right, scary pizzas. I think that's like scary pizzas. Yeah, g give me your scariest pizza. Uh, there yeah, has to be one out you there. See, you know, many of my pizza experiences have always been positive. Okay, I got another one for you. Yeah, I've, I've got scary pasta experiences. That is a close second, but let me tell you about I, scary pizza. I mean, his name is Pepino Spaghetti, so I'll count it. But your, your, your story first. Yeah, the uh, so we have a wood fire pizza place next to us. Yes. And I actually know the owner. Oh. He uh, used to own a place I used to work at. And I'll tell you that story off screen, but, uh, yeah, he opened a wood fire pizza place. And it's like, oh, sweet. Wood fire? Hell yeah. Gotta get some of that, uh, little bit of, little bit of toast on the bottom of the pizza. It's gonna taste great. A little bit of the char, a little bit of the crisp. Fucking destroyed my pizza, and it was charcoal. Oh, no. And I said, hey, this is a little too done. And they said, oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. That sounds see. Uh, that, that sounds like the typical non-wood fire place that I, that, uh, I know of. Mm. Decent pizza service could be questionable. Mm -hmm. Actually, speaking of wood fire, and then we'll get to uh, scary pasta because I can't wait to hear this. 
Uh, did you know that uh, Krino's has a wood fireplace? I thought that's what you were talking about. Oh no, I'm talking about the other place. Other place? The place that is, it's downtown, strictly wood fire. I was thinking of, I was thinking of Krino's wood fire. Oh no, Krino's wood fire was, to quote the kids, that was fire. That was good stuff. Yeah, sound, sounds good. Well, yeah. I've got to get out of my pizza comfort zone here soon. Yeah, tell me your pasta. So, um... Mr. Pizza Pasta. There is this Italian restaurant over in Columbus that is strictly 100% for old people. <laughs> okay. It, it, it is... It's, it's got uh, boring, bland, neutral decor with boring, bland, neutral food. Oh, God, I might know what you're talking about. So, uh... Vi and I went there once with, uh -huh. some, with some family. And, uh, it was... Dude, what I had was... Okay, I mean, I, I, I got the, uh, the, what was it, the, ch the chicken parmesan? Mm-hmm, I love me some chicken parm. Or it was like, or it was like chicken marinara or whatever. Chicken parmesan marinara, something like that. Whatever. It was, it was, it was, it was, it was a thing of fried chicken with marinara on it, and it had parmesan cheese, and, sp and it was on top of, like, pasta. Sweet! That was, it was watery sauce. Oh. It was, it was, it was, it was, you know, it was fine. I think we paid a bit too much for it, but, you know, it's just boring, bland food. But that's not the scary part. Uh oh Violet's dish was the scary part. Uh-oh. They ordered chicken Alfredo. Ooh, are we about to hear watery Alfredo? Or not properly prepared Alfredo? So what's a good Alfredo to you? Tell me about your perfect Alfredo sauce. Uh, nice and creamy. A little hint of garlic in the back half. Nice, creamy, a little bit, a little bit of garlic in there. Maybe some, you, you put some pepper in there. Oh, you know, yeah. Like the little, uh, like, like a little bit of hot pepper flakes. Mm -hmm. But it's, it's, it's creaminess without being overbearing. Just, you know, it, it's, it's, and it Ooh. goes well with the chicken. Are, am I about to hear a paste? Got a little, little paste, uh... Uh, pasta sauce in there. But the thing about Alfredo, it's got that that, that sweetness to it as well, and yeah. also that creaminess. Also, yeah. you know, it's, and, uh, uh -oh. and, and and you bite into this chicken Alfredo, and it tastes like nothing. Oh no, no flavor! I am not. I, I am not oh. joking to you in any way. No hyperbole. No. Violet, Violet turns to me and and says. My chicken Alfredo doesn't taste like anything. <laughs> it's like, oh, you mean it tastes kind of bland? Like, no, it doesn't taste like anything. It's like, what are you talking about? Like, yeah, you gotta taste a little bit. Oh. It's nothing! Oh, it's, it no. doesn't taste like it! It has no flavor! <laughs> I, I get on pizza place for having no spices, but having no flavor in your cream sauce? Are you kidding? <laughs> on your cheese cream sauce, you have no fucking flavor? Oh, no! What kind, what, what kind of embarrassing... And, and, the, oh. and, the, and the best part is, it's right down the street from the pizza place that my, that my folks own! <laughs> it's like, we should have gone down the street! Why do we come here? Oh, God! Why do we come here? So I have to ask you a question. Yeah. Did that restaurant start with an A? Start with an M. M, okay, it's not the one I was thinking of, because... I used to work in an Italian restaurant. That was my, one of my first jobs as a busboy, and then I went back to the kitchen. Was it Pepino Spaghetti's? <laughs> uh, Couldn't well. pay it. Too much in debt. Yeah, too much in debt. No, it's all right. Well, there's uh, not getting hit by the King Ghost Traps. You can hit by anything else, but uh, anything that has a ghost face on it. Uh, the ball machines don't count because they don't hurt you. They just make yeah, it they turn into you a ball. into a ball. But the outlets and the anchors, ouchies. Well now, my friend, we've only got two levels of the whole game left. We're in the home stretch. We're in the home stretch. There's only three levels in the third floor. In the fifth floor, I mean. Mm. Uh, well. And I unfortunately know what's coming, but it is totally worth it. I don't think you know what else. what's really coming. I don't. Oh, what? that's a full John Gutter robot! Yep. Ew! I told you, it's the real John Gutter. Oh, what the hell? Everything we've had up to him has just been parts of him, but this is the real deal. Oh. See you next time on Pizza Tower! More like Terror Tower. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>